Hi, it's Megan. I used to wear a lot of Laura Mercier and then I kind of got away from the brand for a while just because I moved on to other brands. But this winter in Southern California where I am has been super, super hot. I know we're in spring now, but we had 70, 80 degree weather for most of the winter and not every day, but a lot of the days and very little rain. So I started kind of embracing spring and summer collections early. And I also really embraced this sheer lipstick trend. And I had three of the Laura Mercier stick glasses. So according to them, what is it? It is a sheer swipe of moisturizing color, ultra, mo ultra moisturizing lip color, a cross between a lip balm, lip color, and lip glacy. Gives cares for your lips while delivering color in a sheer and sophisticated finish. Flawless and healthy lips are just swipe away. So it has vitamins A, C, and E. Support the natural production of collagen in the lips. I didn't know I needed to do that. And antioxidants. So it is. $23 for 0.13 ounces. This is what it looks like. I'm going to do it on a swatch on my arm of this, but I have them outside too. This is Cortison. Oh, it's not going to show up. Okay, it's right there. You can see it's super glossy and it's on my lips. Now I have super pigmented lips, so I'm going to take these on and off on camera so you can see when you have a sheer formula, the fact that I have super pigmented lips makes a huge difference in how they look. These wear surprisingly long given the sheer formula. Most of them, two of the three, last about two hours on me, which is long for a sheer formula on me. One of them I wore, Peony, and it lasted like three hours. I wore it to the to this, uh, shopping center the other day and I was running errands and I couldn't believe it lasted as long as it did. So Courtesan, the one I'm wearing, is a deep and rose color base and it's kind of got a gold and copper shimmer. And you can see it's kind of a semi-sheer, but it's a shimmery semi sheer and that means it does wear a little bit better in that you get that sparkle for a little bit longer so that is courtesan peony like I said I couldn't believe how long this one lasted and they're actually I don't have a dry lip problem these feel very bomb like they're a harder bullet than some of the other kind of softer sheer formulas but they actually are quite conditioning on me And I just love the look and the effect of them. Um, it's so natural and just my lips are better, right? So um, Peony is an aubergine rose, deep aubergine rose, according to Laura Mercier. It's kind of got a plum. Aubergine is eggplant, but it's kind of got a plum thing. It's got a weird scent to it. Um, I don't know, tutti frutti? Obviously, there's like this weird fruit thing that can't ever quite place. So there it is. Kind of a plum shade. It's on my lips. And even though it's a sheer formula, you can see that I don't have that kind of fading on my top lip, which I get with some sheer formulas. And the last one, so Cortison, according to them, was a mauve rose. Peony is a deep aubergine rose, according to Laura Mercier. And then brown sugar is a sheer mauve nude. This one gets a lot of reviews. Ah, I forgot my Kleenex, so I could stop the camera, but it's easier just to blot it with my hand. This one right here, gets a lot of reviews saying, it's right there, that it's like the perfect nude. And again, my lip color has a huge impact on how these wear, but you can see the soft kind of glistening sheen that I get with the formula. Um, very flattering, and again, it is moisturizing. So I've kind of been re-embracing these. I had them from a Sephora, or from a Laura Mercier set at Christmas time, and I've just been wearing them so much for the past couple weeks, and I've been just loving kind of that natural soft sheen, little glisten to them, but no like glitter glisten, um, and the naturalness of the color. So I think that's it. If you have the fourth color, there are four colors, I have three, I would love to hear and um, other suggestions for formulas like this would be great. Subscribe on YouTube. And on YouTube, I have a novel, Masks, that I'm doing chapter by chapter on YouTube. So I'll put the link for that in the description of this video. And I also do videos from my book, Get Your Child to the Top, a parent-focused education book. That's